Hey! Welcome back to Monster Seed. And in the last episode, we went to Ball's Fortress and finally finished it off. In this episode, I want to go to the town plaza after hatching a couple of monsters. Anyway, first things first. I got myself a new Agumon. Like I already said, his name is Agumon. <laughs> yes. And, uh... I'm thinking of changing a few things. No, not that. Okay, uh, also, I think that actually. Exit. Can I do that with Daniel? New name? Yay! <laughs> Why did I not know this sooner? Um. <laughs> well, since I can change his name. <laughs> okay. Alright, hatching time. Uh, <laughs> sorry about that. Okay, hatching equipment's in the back, and I will make some good use of it. Alright, high energy. Last time I recorded, uh, my computer actually shut the fuck off. So I apologize in advance for the cursing in that previous sentence, which isn't in advance. Anyway, setting the ha uh, harassment seed, uh, which I shouldn't do. But oh well, I'm gonna set it and I'm gonna put sound as its main attribute, do this, and uh, it seems that I want to go to one. And this is a Kugla self, or a Kugla self. Kugis, yeah, Kugis self. Really hard to say, uh, say. Quite fast and determined, and its stats are kind of shit. But hey, it attacks with sound. And, uh, yeah. All of it is just element downs. But it can cause paralysis, so it's not really that great, but I kind of like them. They're kind of cool. Um, changing the parameters for naming, because I can. And, uh, yeah. And I know it looks nothing like one. But, hey, I like the name. Uh, I'm gonna sell this seed, I'm gonna set this one, and this one is, uh, actually, no, I'm not gonna set this one. I'm gonna set this one. Use you, 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 uh, you, you, and... Yeah, that's it. And I want to set you to three. Possibly what I should have been getting earlier. Um, but then again, I never really knew about this monster. So, yes. Quite fast and lazy. Oh well. It's amazing. Mega press, and that's deep sleep, skull masher, hammer whip. And uh, yeah, this is a Zua. And there's only one name befitting this Zua, and it's not Emerson. I know it's not like uh, 50 feet tall and uh, and have a dragon penis, but still. Um. Reminds me of Zork. Now, uh, next one that I gotta kinda set is this. And I'm setting that too. Uh, not that one. Not that one. That, yes. And, uh, those, yes. And that too. Why not? Uh, let's see. Set you up to nine. Because, yay! That is a boogie. It's not really a great monster.
Okay. Um, um, I don't know why it's so crap, but hey, it's a boogie. Um, It's actually kind of amazing that they've got so much stuff that you can put in a name here. <laughs> Fuck. I don't know what to name him. Fathead. I know what it says, but it's Fathead. Or Fathead. That's it. Fathid. Um, I want to hatch two of you. Um, and that's good for now. Yeah, eight, I think. Now I need to check. Yeah, that's eight. No! Oh, well. It's not a big deal. So I go back here and hatch two more things and then I'll be pretty much done. Maybe three. Three if I'm lucky. Okay, uh, this is six and that's magic attacking. So yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna hatch three. The rest of these are gonna be sold. Um just because, in the interest of, I want to show everything off, I'm gonna... Let's see. Eight. And I know I can get another thing by five, but I just don't want to. Um, I actually don't mind these. And this one's actually not bad. Uh, it has nothing on that recovers HP, and uh, also raises your defense. Yeah. You can see why I don't mind these. These are actually okay. Um, oh, uh, I know exactly. Yeah. I know it looks really next to nothing like it, but still. You, okay, um... Three, no... Three... Hatching. Because if I go anywhere away from what I'm doing, it's gonna actually be disastrous. Okay, this is Camfo. Pretty good stats. Can't take a hit, of course. Fin Desua, Stone Desua, Jing Desua. Basically, recovery for everything. And then elements up. So, yeah, this is actually one of those that I think you should get if you're going to go with a good assist one. No, it's not going to be Steinbeck, even though that would be kind of cool. And, um,. I know exactly what I'm going to name him. I'm cooler than you are. Or calmer than you are, rather. Anyway. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's see. This is number six, so i got to go to five. Five time. Five time. Five time. Five time the disappointment. Especially whenever it doesn't turn out anything like I want it to. This is a cham cham. Oh, wow. It turned out better than I expected. It doesn't do anything there, but it does have ice, lightning, and ice. And because I raised its ice powers... 
Yeah, um... Yeah. Mailer. No. Um... Because Dan Green made an ep uh, made a, uh... Made a cameo. Shut up, I'm a geek. Yeah, a few of them, actually. Not the least being my Zom. You can help me by selling my seeds. Granted, selling monsters gets you more than selling seeds. And selling solutions gets you more than selling monsters. But it's not really worth the time or effort to hatch things to get things. Especially whenever you don't have all the things that you need. Anyway, Town Chief, talk to me. I see you helped out to uh, save Mao. That's good. Here's the rest of the money I promised you. Thank you. I'm not going to hesitate in taking it. Fine! Town Chief, have you got something else for me to do? Yes, I've got some more work for you. But take a rest for a while. Cal's been worrying about you. Oh, really? Then I'll go and visit Cal at her home. That was a little awkward. <laughs> it's great to be young. There are so many pleasures in life. Huh? Dude, you are so oblivious. And then check it out. Ow. The town chief must have misunderstood something between me and Cal? Needless question mark. And here we get to hear about Johnny's grand dream. My ambition is to establish a great Gajan Empire, and I'll be the Emperor. Emperor Johnny! I have no time to waste with you. Don't disturb me. That's a big ambition. Of course it is. The size of the ambition is the size of the man. Dimwit Johnny. Huh? Did you say something? Nothing. Yeah. Johnny's got a big dream. One punch Johnny. Now it's time to talk to Cal. Well done! Thank you. By the way, Cal. Yes? Did you tell the town chief anything about us? No, I didn't tell him anything. Did the town chief say something, man? No. Nothing special. But... Well... Huh? Well... Because, um... Strange. <sighs> yeah, I'm not gonna talk to Uru either. Um... The only way to get better is to actually stick with voices, and, uh... I hate being in falsetto, by the way. <laughs> it may not sound like it, but... Oh, falsetto kills me. Yeah, now to wait for the town chief to turn all the way around. Oh, you! How was Cal? Um, have you misunderstood something? About what? I haven't misunderstood anything. You're young. Don't be so shy. 
What? <laughs> ah, young people. Oh no, that's not good. Everything with the town chief is kind of just like laughable. Town chief. What? Was the gang's... What was the gang's reason for building the fortress on the Hill of Fall? I don't understand anything in detail, but it seems that Jeed's mine and the Fimmel ruins have something to do with it. The Hill of Fall is the best location for controlling Jeed's mine and the Fimmel ruins. Jeed's mine and the Fimmel ruins. Jeed's mine used to be a, a booming place. But it's no good now, because of the robbers. Normal people can't get anywhere near it. Huh. Now you came to mention it, Jeed's mine is the location of the next job I'm giving you. Well, that is if I can ask you to do it. Let me hear it. The job will be to find some herbs. The client will be the master of the item shop. The location is Jeed's Mine, which I mentioned. It's a dangerous place. There are robbers and wild monsters. But the herbs grow only in the mountains of this mine. Huh. The herb is called Molu. It's blue. It's blue in color and grows where it's sunny. And the master of the item shop tried many times to go himself, but he failed. Finally, the herbs have come out and he's in trouble. Says that he can't carry more on his medicine business unless he gets a hold of some herbs. So you can go there for. Uh, so can you go there for him? I understand. That's not a yes or a no. Right. So now I'm asking you. Please get some molu and take it straight to the item shop. Then you'll receive your reward. I'll do it. God, you're a pushover. Catch it! Catch it! No, oh, I wanted a bird. Anyway, there's the Morgan de uh, Department Store, and that's where I need to go. Um, first though, I'm getting one battle in against Weak Live or Got Evil. Got Evil. Okay. Um, never mind. <laughs> this is Jeed's mine, and this is where we'll pick up next time. I don't know how long I've been playing, but uh, something tells me it's a little bit too long. Maybe about 14-15 minutes. But uh, this is where the Black Ropes gang is hiding. This is Jeed's mine. And we'll pick up here next time. And, uh... Yeah. Here's the White Armor in. Welcome! May I help you? My hair wants you to stay the night. Anyway, I'm saving. So this is good night to you guys, and I will see you next time. Thalaman out.